Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 3 Late Night, part either 12 or 13. Honestly, can't remember. I was just so excited to jump on here and play a little bit of a late night. Um, so I believe it has been a week or maybe like six or seven, maybe like six days since I uploaded the last part. Um, and the majority of you guys wanted storyline number two, where basically we kind of add more drama in here. And I'm so down for that. So ready to spice it up and throw in a little bit of drama here. So, um, I know I said I wanted to actually film a lot more of the, um, dine out for The Sims 4, but to be honest with you guys, I was just really wanting to play The Sims 3 late night, so that's exactly what I'm doing today. So, I think what we're gonna do, it's Monday, and we're going to invite over Emmy, and we're gonna have her, like, come into our household, and I just have, um, basically everybody's out and about doing all of their stuff to get some extra money in the house even though we really don't need it we have twenty eight thousand smolians which is pretty crazy um and also emmy emmy okay let's ask her well let's have um let's have logan ask emmy and see if she says any different if she says any different i'm going to be honestly like so shocked so let's go ahead and have him call her invite her over see how this goes okay good i was like okay if this is like all messed up i don't know what we're gonna do but um so let's see how he's doing so he is actually really really thirsty so we're having clean out the bad food and have a quick meal of some plasma orange juice and i was gonna say one more thing and i totally forgot what i was going to say oh um logan actually has a little bit of a celebrity drama issue on his hands where he has been convicted of whooming in public so after he gets out of work today which is going to be around 7 p.m because you have two hours till he has to go into work um we're going to have him kind of file a complaint over at the city hall we're going to sue for slander and yeah so okay i was like this is taking them such a long time to finish that but hopefully we can invite emmy over i'm gonna go on ahead and go over to her house and just see if she's home um to see if we can go visit her okay yeah she's home um okay so guys like visit go hurry we're gonna wait for them to come over here well we're gonna wait for blaine to come over here because i'm gonna ask her if she wants to move in with us and hopefully hopefully she says yes I do and also this is her husband because apparently every single person in um bridgeport wants to be married so i feel like horrible or <laughs> breaking up all these families but guys if everybody's married like how else are we supposed to like date people you know what i'm saying like there's nobody single in this town so let's go on ahead and have him hurry over please emmy do not go to work if she goes to work i'm going to be honestly like so mad right now but come on like how far away are you blaine are you like even near her house or is he still at home oh my gosh okay come on go oh i was like who is this okay good he's right there so seriously emmy do not move stay where you are like we're trying to get you to come into our household oh my gosh we're gonna have five sims in our house that's gonna be a lot of simoleons for us i feel like our um like our ambitions household needs a little bit more cash we could just like you know transfer their money over to them maybe they don't i kind of forgot how much money they have in their account um but anyway, i feel like right now out of all my sims 3 lps definitely late night has the most simoleons maybe pets is ahead of them not exactly sure but i mean they did pretty good for themselves like we didn't use any cheats with this family they earned it all logan go to work oh he's cleaning himself up what why is he cleaning him? Whatever. I don't know. So we're going to go here, visit them. <sighs> okay, come on. Let's go. Logan's late for work. We'll go to work. Perform your job. Run. Okay. The kids were excited to see a star of your caliber show up in person. Judging by the number of camera flashes, it seems the paparazzi was excited as well. So yay. Good for us. Perform your job. She late for work too. Yes. Great. So visit them going ahead okay we also need to oh he wants to be mean to alan poor alan we also need to um kind of like figure out where reuben and lydia are because we're kind of been you know focusing on blaine recently 
join the nectar that is actually so random like why do you want to join the nectar making career all right so let's go ahead and pause let's see okay so she's up here i believe this is her room i mean i don't think alan wants to sleep in a pink bedroom with like all this detail in a pink bathroom maybe i don't know but i'm guessing that's really not what he wants to do so we're going to kind of be a little bit romantic and i really want her to come and live with us in our house and apparently we can't do that so guys i might have to add her to our family like you know kind of using the testing cheats option here but i don't want to have like i don't want to do that but i feel like we have no option to and i really want to like start all this drama because if she doesn't want to, uh, you know if she doesn't want, uh, 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 if she doesn't want what someone around time bring a rumor that okay why is everybody like wanting to bash us today like yeah now we have two people that are publicly disgraced in our family great we are the really winning here all right so let's see here let's go on ahead and I mean like their relationship level is seriously so high so i don't know why we can't invite her to come to our house so guys i like i hate using cheats i hate it so much but i feel like we're gonna have to add her to our active family because she just does not want to come like to come to our family so we're adding her in here oh my gosh like i feel, I feel like our family is growing so much okay so she has the unusual blemish Ooh um so these are her traits she's a perfectionist a hothead um she dislikes children so yeah we're gonna want to you know have a kid with her might be difficult um she's charismatic and she's also a light sleeper so she is currently best friends with logan who's a vampire her oh they, oh they weren't married okay good so it's only her ex-boyfriend she hates her boss who's a werewolf nice and she hates lydia okay well you know what she, people are not gonna really want to get along with her what does she wants to do she wants to meet a sim with the sim finder app what there's a sim finder app once in a, once upon a time sims had to make plans in advance now meeting and finding your new sim is a snap and your sim wants to meet someone um excuse me you are like engaged right now what even is this is do we really have a sim finder app i have no idea what is this oh okay it says travel with such. oh my gosh can i talk today travel with such an unusual blemish It'd be wrong of emmy to expose other sims i was like she is not pregnant okay phone settings nope okay let's see here um social networking sim finder app oh my gosh when the heck did the, when did this become a thing guys i had no idea honestly i have had university since the day it came out i had no idea we had a sim finder app definitely guys guys Ooh, where's my sign right here i'm an aquarius um okay let's see here traits guys you know what i'm not about this right now i mean she has basically two guys fighting over her but i just want to see the whole si no you know who we're gonna do this for well she wants to do it and it's gonna count as her aspiration <sighs> no i'm sorry we're using it on scarlet because scarlet is a are you not at work still oh no i was like excuse me excuse me honey you you need to go to work like go are you about H how are you working seriously okay here's what we're going to do social network what why does she not have the option okay well i guess we're going to do it with emmy i'm sorry <sighs> well okay here we go we're going to open up the sim finder app i wonder if she's like at a certain level in the okay she is a social networking five so that's probably why i have never known because my sims honestly um i don't like i don't, I don't really use it that much so let's see we're gonna have we're just gonna totally make stuff up we're gonna say athletic i'm going to say computer whiz and we're going to say dramatic i wonder how this works honestly i mean star is late for work the sim fighter app has found a match fabian what what so it just like brings sim like brings a sim over to your house 
what fabian peterson will be right over guys i am serious is this him yes what what is his traits like is he exactly that like are those exactly his traits i am honestly right now i am like n i am so just wowed by this okay so we're gonna have her take two days of unpaid time off before we say hi to him do not use that app anymore okay so we use the app we're done we're gonna introduce ourselves to him oh, she wants to go to work i'm sorry I'm sorry but you're not gonna go to work you're gonna call in okay emmy star met a new sim in the best way possible through solace online um programs okay <gasps> no <laughs> guys there is seriously it's complete metamorphic oh this is this is just lovely um i feel as if a part of me has died yet everything sorry like yet every other fiber in my being is raging with vitality i crave something yet i don't know what it's like a thirst dot dot dots here we go ah uh, okay so excited right now So there she goes. She's now a vampire. And okay, guys, I think Emmy needs a makeover. Like, not to lie. I feel like we need to kind of spruce her up a bit. And I, I don't know if I want to take the time out of, you know, this. Like, out of, you know, this part to act. Wait, are we going to, like, wait for something to change? Oh, yeah, we have to wait for her traits and stuff. So currently, her favorite food is key lime pie. But in a second, that's all going to change. So Blaine is cooking. Has no idea what just happened. I am like seriously so into this LP right now, guys. Like, whoa. Well, I'm seriously so into this LP right now, guys. Like, this is actually the best thing ever. So, yeah, we're just going to. Are you going to like finish? Is this a top? Oh, yeah, this is a top and a skirt. Okay, I was like, what is that weird line? Okay, come on. Finish. Finish what you got to finish here. It's not going to take you that long. Come on, just 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 you know finish do, do your thing you got you got um, whatever his name is oh she's a she's a good friend carissa wells okay oh here he is fabio you you fabian waiting for you, you know what we have all these things that we need to do today so go ahead and, pre and present your check okay life as a vampire has great oh can you like see her eyes glowing through her sunglasses oh my that is actually kind of terrifying like walking on the street like um yeah you are honestly scaring me so right here she has a little bite mark even though she was bit in the wrist you know i don't really understand that um but anyway life as a vampire has great benefits but it also has some costs so we're gonna read about that but we're just going to you know lightly scroll through and say yes 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 okay so she just transformed into the creature of the night i honestly like i am dying to do a supernatural lp but i know i have way too many lps going on right now so we gotta like probably finish three of them before that even becomes a possibility but i am right now like i'm thinking you know what? like what if blaine was a werewolf i mean i'm just like thinking about all these other things but we're not gonna go there okay so we are going to really quickly go on ahead and give her a makeover i'm just gonna pause this um and come and come right back to you guys when her makeover is done because this is bothering me that she looks this way so yeah i'm gonna go on ahead and kind of change up her appearance for a little bit and then get back to you guys in just a second okay guys so i am now back and done with her makeover that took me way longer than it probably should have um now her outfit's not like my favorite by any means at all i was trying to find stuff that i had in my um like you know custom content wardrobe area that i feel like would fit kind of like the theme we're going for here and i was trying to look for more like edgy stuff and this is definitely more like you know going out and i mean i think it kind of resembles late night um i'm probably going to look for some other stuff as well and kind of change up some stuff um but as you can see from her previous um profile when you're looking at her either where she's listed at the bottom of our other sims or where she's next to the sun and the moon um definitely more of a drastic change for her definitely drastic um i was trying to keep her um basically you know like her old um like business attire look she had going on the same but eventually i was like you know what she's gonna be young forever so i was you know i was thinking like 
why have her be all businessy and dressed up if she's gonna have basically you know her whole entire life to get her you know life together um so anyway i gave her a little i gave her darker hair i had her as a um like as a brunette and then i was like Ugh, i kind of want her to go like with black like like you know, like a darker brunette black hair um and i added like these little earrings the only thing i don't like about these earrings that i put on her is like if you look at her Ugh, this way that one kind of like pops out of her ear it's, i mean it's not like it's the worst thing ever but it's just a little annoying um and then i just kind of darkened up her makeup and gave her some false lashes and i put contacts over her really like bright beaming eyes to kind of calm them down and yeah i mean again her outfit's probably not going to stay or be a permanent thing but just for now i'm kind of going through like you know when she transitioned she kind of went to like this you know like different demeanor i mean she's definitely not like you know I know she definitely is different than how she looked before and obviously Blaine has no idea that you know she changed as quickly um so yeah hang on just one second guys I'm just saying really fast you guys sorry about that um, i had to take a really quick phone call but anyway Blaine has obviously no idea that Emmy looks like that and he's you know kind of thinking like that's not really you know like the girl I fell in love with kind of thing and you know obviously logan has no idea that she trained what, what what is this take a cell phone no don't do that obviously you know logan has no idea that she is now a vampire and transition and transitioned into a vampire so it'll be really interesting for him to find that out so let's go on ahead guys i'm gonna film back-to-back -back parts after this this is honestly has me so excited okay so we're gonna have her go downstairs and see um logan or not logan blaine where, wherever he always cooking that's right um over here and we're gonna have her uh, <gasps> offer no we're gonna have him drink from her this is what i'm this is what i'm kind of going for okay she's kind of right now she's out of control what why didn't we just get this i think we just got that with lydia but anyway like this is kind of like my little story we're gonna tell here um she's kind of you know she's new to this she doesn't know what she wants and as it said like she has a thirst for something in the little notification that we got previously so you know she doesn't really know what's going on with her she obviously knows something's different about her but she doesn't really know what yet so she's going to go on ahead and just kind of you know greet blaine by basically saying you know like hey i'm a vampire now and i'm thirsty so she is going to go on ahead and drink from him this honestly i you know i'm so glad that you guys wanted to do storyline number two because i feel like it just adds a lot more um you know like drama into the lp which i am like excited for so here she is she's going oh ooh, oh oh logan's messing everything up over here okay so this is actually i think it's our first time um i don't know i'm taking a screenshot but basically this is our first time having a vampire in our late night lp actually like drink from the neck because usually they always do it from the wrist i don't know so let's go on ahead and go this way then whoopsie that's a bad angle we gotta get low oh no Caleb, right here we're gonna switch, switch like this okay so let's go ahead and watch this happen oh shoot now i wanted to go on the other <sighs> guys i'm so sorry i've been so bad with camera angles all right here he is obviously not looking too thrilled here here she, okay this is nice this is you know this is nice i guess okay so oh 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 okay I wonder if we can like see her fangs or something. Sorry guys, I keep moving the camera around. Oops. Okay. No, you can't. Well, I mean, you kind of Oh, I was like, who is that over there? There is her ex-boyfriend just like nothing's happening. So casual. All right. Well, here we go. Oops. Oh, oh. Oh, she has a ring on her finger. We might need to take that off. okay well obviously he looks like he's pretty dazed and can okay i seriously i should have done this in the first place this camera movement is so much better so anyway guys um yeah that's basically oh oh that is a really awkward shot but um there you go you guys can kind of see her fangs there she has two sets of fangs which i thought they had one but whatever that's fine so she is basically you know up their relationship for some reason he finds her alluring or no blaine yeah okay um weird so anyway you know like i mean she's obvious no could you imagine <gasps> could you imagine that no never okay so let's go on ahead 
and um no have them make out and then we're going he has to work late guys so and i'm ending this part in i think two minutes oh actually like a minute so yeah we're gonna leave it off here we're gonna you know continue the drama in the next part two parts back to back coming your way um probably saturday or maybe i'll upload this video tomorrow which is friday maybe i'll do friday and saturday videos or i'll do saturday sunday videos Ugh, i really want to like film another part of this so yeah i'll probably upload this video friday and then i'll upload the other video on saturday so you guys get excited i am excited like seriously so excited for this to actually start and begin i am so ready for this next chapter of this late night lp so with that being said i'm going to go on ahead in this part here you guys in the next part we're going to have um obviously emmy is going to see logan for the first time and it's going to be a life changer for both of them and for blaine and obviously you know we're kind of on the back burner with these two but lydia will have her boyfriend come over in the next part as well if we have time i'll probably make that make that part like half an hour long because obviously this drama is too much to handle in like 20 minutes so yeah i'm gonna go ahead in this part here guys hope you guys all enjoyed if you did please feel free to give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you guys all in the next video bye guys hey guys and thank you so much for watching this video if you enjoyed this video please feel free to give it a thumbs up and yeah if you guys want to subscribe go on ahead and click that button down below to you know be notified whenever i upload a video and yeah i love you guys all so much and i'll see you guys all next time bye guys